the Seahawks offense coming back onto the field here desperately trying to avoid a repeat of their last drive when they had the quick three and out I'll tell you what if they go three and out again you know what's going to happen those defensive players are going to be looking at them as they come off the field you put this back out there already so it's important to get a drive give your defense a little rest plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one first down at the 23 Ellington's going to secure the handoff The Seahawks come to the line with an empty backfield from the gun. Going deep. The ball is taken out of his hands. And now here's the Saints defense. They are a brute force that can dictate a game from the very start. It's third down coming up. The Seahawks have to get to the 33 for a first. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. Heaving it down the field. And he comes down. No, the defender tips it out. Late in the first, and that's a big stop on third down to bring up a punt. And now they'll look to extend the lead. Yeah, good job by the defense, but I'll say this for the the offense you got to show more imagination if you want to have success especially on third downs Thomas is just going to wave his arm here and make the fair catch The Saints are going to line up. Close game. Second quarter. The scores 7 to 0. The Seahawks defense now is going to go nickel. The Saints now moves the chains. Games 18. That's reception number two for him. Jackson's job is to sell that play fake. And boy, did he do it that time. It fooled the defense, and they get the completion. First and ten. Jackson's going to scramble out to Stills. The Saints coaching staff has done a good job of mixing things up today on first down. The pass. The defense off guard. They pick up solid yards. Now it's second and short. Coming to the line at the 49. Second down, two to go. Curley's going to take the handoff now. Tavares Jackson will be taking this one from the gun. Now first and ten. This would be ruled incomplete. Didn't get the feet down. Good job that time by the secondary. They're in good position. 
they make the play and it's an incomplete pass by the quarterback. Second down after the incompletion. Quarters formation here for the defense. From the shotgun. He'll throw it over the middle. And intercepted. And he's brought to the ground. Wagner was able to show off those great hands in picking off that pass from the linebacker position. What a job and what a pair of hands. The Seahawks offense is on the field, hoping to erase the memory of their last drive, which was completely unproductive, a quick three and out. Yeah, it was. I don't know if they can erase this defense. This defense is pretty good. We saw that in the last drive, and they got good players, and they're pretty excited, so this is going to be tough on the offense. And gains about one. This is one good tackling defense. They stay in good position at all times, and we saw it that time, and they stopped the play for a short game. Coming up, second down. on the screen tackle made by bird that time first down and ten Wilson with the give Ellington is tackled down second down after going to the ground game the first play Wilson from the shotgun Wilson running away from the pressure. And he's tackled down after picking up the first. The Seahawks take it from the 33. Ellington is tackled down after a play that went for six. Always good to have these types of runs. Hey, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Looking across the middle. Tackles made, and the first down is picked up. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Tim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. Wilson's lined up no extra blockers for this snap. Bryant's got it. Screen play. They'll end up losing five on the run. And now we reach the two-minute warning here in the second quarter. That's second down coming up. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Wilson's got it in the gun. Bring him to the turf. Woodyard, such an impressive athlete. We know we can tackle and stop the run game, but how about that in the pass game? Defending the pass and picking it off. Good job. The Saints will try to hold on to the football. This has been one big turnover after another, Phil. Just what the coaches talked about in our meetings with him this week about ball security. It's not happening here. Well, it tells you the uh, players did not listen to the coaches, that's for sure, because ball security is not what we're seeing out there. I know this. Next week in practice, there's going to be a lot of drills about hanging on to the football. Look at that. Everybody at the line of scrimmage. The defense showing a blitz. Second down and 13. My goodness, what a hit. And the ball falls incomplete. Well, when you get in a situation like this, Jim, and you get third and long, I'll tell you what catches a defense by surprise. Run a double move on the outside against the defensive back because everybody in the stands and the defensive players all think you're going to throw it short. On the way, third down. And Rice is out wide on the left. Tiger, Tiger. The quarterback 
He's changing the play with the wide receiver with those hand signals. And that incompletion is going to bring us to a very quick fourth down. They're set to punt it away now. We'll see what he can do here. And picks up maybe three or four. The Seahawks have to still be thinking about that last possession. They were actually moving down the field. And then, of course, the untimely interception ended things. Yeah, the defense, look, they got good players. And, you know, you give them enough chances, they're finally going to make the play. You have to be careful with the football. The offense was not, and that's why it resulted in an interception. What do you think they're talking about in that huddle after that drive-killing interception? Well, they're probably telling the quarterback, if you do that again, we're going to kick you out. I don't know, but they, they got to play better. Managing that clock, such a big deal in the NFL. That's why they're hurrying up. Don't use that timeout. Keep those timeouts because that is going to maybe give you a chance.